I see. I'm gonna get a shrine of. Let's do Poseidon. So I can get ship bonuses and stuff. Commander. There's still an annoying amount of Libyans scattered all over the map. And let's go take out this Epirus Navy. Or not Epirus. Etruscan League. Not yet. There we go. Okay, in turn. Never mind. I'm just gonna give you governing stuff since I don't need you to fight. Bonus to tax rate will be good. And now in turn. <clears throat> well, apparently, after taking my navy out of Thapsis, uh, the rebels decided that they could attack me and they can um, you know I'm gonna fight this battle hopefully we'll win I probably won't since they have elephants and two units of Carthaginian hoplites and I have absolutely crap units so yeah Oh well though, uh, I'm gonna kill as many of them as possible just to make it easier on myself when I retake Thapsis. I didn't really think about that. I didn't think that taking my navy out would be a bad idea, but I guess it was. Whoops. Hopefully I have javelin men on my naval units. Yes I do, I can use these guys for the elephants. So I might have a chance in this battle. We'll see. I'm just gonna rush to the city center. No special tactic here. Oh my god, are you guys brain dead? Just row to the shore! I don't know why my frame rate is just dropping suddenly. It'll be at like almost 30 one second then. See, now it's weird now it's like up to... Oh, when I zoom into the city it just gets awful. But when I look away it goes... Not even when I look away, it's just random. It was up to almost four. Okay, now it's back up to almost 40. Wow. I just like, I, I hit a wall. And the frame rate just absolutely... Explodes. I don't know what's up with this. It's happened to me before in siege battles where 
it's just ridiculously low. And I know my computer can handle it because I've had plenty of siege battles where I get perfectly fine frame rates with more soldiers than it, what's in this battle. See, now it's randomly back up to like 30. Makes no sense. Hang on. Alright, hopefully that helps a little bit. Kind of. I don't know. General! Having fraps on definitely isn't helping. Okay, so Carthage... Uh... So I don't know if the whole army is planning on coming around right to that side. So I'm hesitant to move. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna place... I guess our whole army's going that way, in that direction. So I'm gonna get ready. Well, no, it appears... Oh my god. This... This lag. Some units are coming down this road. So I'm gonna do... Oh my god. Like, down to two frames. For a, like 10 seconds and it jumps up to... This never happened to me before. What well, has, but not in like a month. Gonna keep my javelin in back uh, for the elephants. Gonna go go into hoplite wall here. And hopefully, my guys stand somewhat of a chance. Although I'm not getting my hopes up. Okay, elephants are coming down this side. So I'm gonna get my javelin men up here quickly. I'm actually going to go ahead and tell my slingers to fire at the elephants just to weaken them up a bit. They're not going to be as effective as javelin men, however. Doing the lag thing again in case you didn't notice. So the elephants they will, will definitely do a lot of damage, but charging into the back of their own men like that uh, really slowed them down, and they won't do nearly as much damage as they could have. And my javelins are now shooting at them, so they will start to die pretty quickly, actually. If I can get them to go amok, they'll actually kill a lot of their own guys. Um, but that will be dangerous for me as well, too. Alright, so all the elephants are dead now. I'm gonna train my fire onto their hoplites. Also, none of them are going down that side anymore, so I will start 
to uh, send in my reinforcements here. I'm actually, hopefully I can get the mob. I should have already done this. Uh, it's, it was a mistake on my part. But use the mob to hold off these guys while I can uh, use numbers with all my hoplites combined against their Carthaginian hoplites. That was some tactical error on my part. Yeah, here come my reinforcements. Um, hopefully that that in numbers will help us win, actually. So my mob, they will hold them off for a little bit, uh, pre prevent them from firing missiles, which is all I really need. And look here, we did route one unit, and now we can flank the other one, so we actually might have a good chance in this battle if we can get this other Carthaginian hoplite routed quickly. Because all they will have left at this point will be Peltis and uh, Mob. So sure enough, we did route the other Hoplite. And I can go ahead and rush all my Hoplites into their uh, crowd of Mob and Peltis. Also, this uh, Javelin's out of ammo, so there's no point keeping around. I can charge him in. Just add some numbers to the fight. My other javelin's also about to be out of ammo, so I can uh, keep watch for that and send them in as soon as possible. So now it's just going to be a grind out fight. Thank goodness uh, my game stopped lagging. I don't know what the heck was going on earlier. Nice kill. Javelin men, I saw that. My javelin men are getting a lot of kills, actually. Which is surprising, because uh, their pelters have shields. Uh, although their pelters probably have been weakened a bit by... Um, by uh, missile fire. So they're starting to waver, which is good. That means I am definitely going to win this battle. None of my hoplites, or my two remaining hoplite units that have barely taken any casualties, uh, definitely are stronger than their peltists. So there's no reason that I'm not going to win this fight. Just get you some close-up action right now. Close out all the menus and hugs. That button is K, by the way, if you were wondering, to close out all this. And also, in is to do a cinematic view, like that. Just some extra tips to add cinematic value to your gaming experience, and we have one. But I will, uh, I want to pursue for a little bit. Just because uh, this rebellion probably won't die since they do have quite a few guys left. Almost an entire unit of Carthaginian hoplites uh, escaped. They had like 70 guys left, so I think they will come back. So I'm going to try to prevent them from doing that. Show you guys more guys getting killed too. Room 2 definitely has some cool uh, killing animations. I don't think they did as well as they could have, because Shogun 2 had some pretty, pretty badass ones. So I was really hoping for a lot with Room 2. I was kind of let down though with the killing animations, but the ones that they do have are pretty cool. I just wish they had more, really. Alright, so that's all. My battle was, or my game was starting to lag again, so I was getting worried, so I just decided to quit. It doesn't lag on campaign map. I don't know why it has to lag in a battle like that. Since there weren't even really that many soldiers. It fixed itself though, so hopefully uh, the problem will be will be uh, done with.